This is Twit. This episode of Hands on Tech is brought to you by Plex. Plex is offering $10 off the lifetime Plex Pass subscription for new subscribers only at plex.tv slash twit, code twit10. Here is Lenovo Smart Display. This is a 7-inch one. It is much smaller than the 8 and 10-inch ones that were announced uh, slash launched last year. This one does not flip over this way the way the last two did. It only works this way. And uh, it's about the size of the Nest Hub, if you're familiar with it. Uh, same screen size, around 7 inches. IPS display. But the thing about this is that it has a camera right here. Uh, thankfully, there is a little slider if you don't want, you know, the camera to be on because I can understand why. Now, this is not the kind of thing that you're going to put at your bedside because of that camera thing is what I say. If you want something that goes by your bedside, you want to get the Lenovo Smart Clock. That's that's the thing that goes by your bedside. This one, uh, right now, this is hanging out in my office and it's become my... Uh, my periphery 90210 streaming device. So when I do my fifth rewatch of season five, I'm doing it on this thing. And it's great because the sound, uh, there's two 1.5 inch five watt speakers and a passive radiator, which are pointed directly at you here at the bottom. So the sound is pointed at you so I can hear all the dialogue perfectly of the 70th time that Kelly chooses herself. Uh, so I'm just <laughs> nice. gonna, Thank you, Ron, for getting that. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and um, put on a little lo-fi hip-hop. So we're casting it through Spotify right now. Now, this thing is bassy. This thing is really bassy, and I like it. Um, it sounds really nice. I have it actually paired as a home group in my office with the new second-gen Nest Mini, and the Nest Mini, as you may know, when you put it up against the wall, it kind of uses the wall to reverberate bass. And it sounds great in conjunction with this. I, I kind of love this little like stereo pairing that I put in the room. And then, okay, Burke is telling me to turn it all the way up. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. It's all about that bass. All right, let's see if you can feel this on the table, huh? Can you feel that, folks? Maybe? No? I don't know. Yeah. It's it's bassy. Uh, it's shaken. Oh, okay. Burke wants me to hold it up to the mic. Okay, let me do that for you. It's it's lo-fi hip hop. All right. I'm not gonna put I'm not gonna put something to get us in trouble with rights. Uh, so the nice thing about this it has really nice viewing angles, as you can see, like from either side. Uh, you're getting crisp, clear vision. Um, the camera resolution on this thing, it's two megapixels instead of five, like on the other Lenovo smart displays. Uh, there is also a hardware mute button on the, oop, on the top, excuse me. Uh, kind of like in the other, uh, smart displays. Yep, I know. It also has, okay, I heard ya. It also has Bluetooth 5.0 rather than 4.2, like on the older displays. Um, and it does have the ability to adjust automatically, um, but I am not using it that way because I'm using it, it has a color sensor. So it kind of like, it knows how to adjust the picture based on the lighting in your room. But I haven't been using that just because, you know, it's just been sitting in my office. But it is, you know, it's a nice little, if you're thinking about getting a smart display, you don't want to get the Nest Hub necessarily. It's MSRP $130, but exclusively you can get it for 100 bucks at B&H if you order it through B&H. They're giving you 30% off for the holiday. So if you're interested in, in, in maybe you want to check this out instead of the Nest Hub, maybe because maybe you do want a camera and you want to stick with the 7-inch size, something worth considering. Lenovo, they've done a really good job with the smart displays. I'm still using the 10-inch in the kitchen. It's still our kitchen display. Um we're, we clean it off with a little bit of uh, the method purple stuff is what I call it because, you know, it can get greasy in the kitchen. This one so, I think is better in the bedroom if uh, you're thinking was, of getting it. I'm going to I'm going to avoid that and I'm going to ask you the question I was going to ask, which you kind of answered. But it seems like this would be a great like alarm clock. 
device. No, I really like no? the Lenovo smart clock for that. Yeah. Because Yeah, because I don't want something super complicated. I actually have the Nest Hub in my bedroom because it doesn't have the camera. So I'm not like, I'm not as weirded out. And that's my little like, you know, when I'm playing podcasts or watching something while doing my makeup. This one, it's, I think it's a good idea if you maybe have a smaller family room and you don't want to have such a big display because you have a TV that kind of thing. It's a good smart home controller. And then just very quickly, actually, Victor, if you don't mind the overhead, just very quickly, I'm just going to show you. Remember that these are kind of the new, this is the new way to do everything. So, oh, geez, it's kind of bright. So you can't really see it that well. Which I got to admit, ultimately, like, this is less about the device and more about the Google Home interface. Yeah. I am liking the new interface since the rollout, but I will say the, the swipe up menu that you do to get volume and everything, when you have player, like if you're watching video and you have player controls and getting that to swipe up on top mm -hmm. of player controls gets very frustrating and confusing. Yeah. So, so. there you go. Lenovo Smart Display, 100 bucks at B&H, 130 if you find it anywhere else. Hands on Tech brought to you by Plex. With Plex, you can organize and stream your personal collection of movies, TV shows, music, and photos anywhere on any device. Give your media the royal treatment it deserves with the Plex Pass and get premium features including premium music, mobile sync, trailers, parental controls, and more. Plex is offering $10 right now off the Lifetime Pass subscription. For new subscribers only, here's what you do. Go to plex.tv slash twit and use the offer code TWIT10. That's plex.tv slash twit, code TWIT10. Keep up with all the hottest tech news and gadgets. Visit twit.tv. There you'll be able to find and subscribe to all our tech shows. Thanks for watching Hands on Tech.